Welcome everybody to our token on the show. This is Corey coming to you around Richmond, Virginia. An exciting day for us. I've got my partner Deb Caswell over there in sunny San Diego. We're going to have an exciting day, a short tutorial, tutorial, tutorial on um, MetaMask and how to connect, how to set up your Binance Smart Chain on your MetaMask. So it comes with the Ethereum mainnet. We're going to get the BSC, which is also known as Binance Smart Chain, onto your MetaMask so that we can have some fun with, you guys are probably hearing about Safe Moon, Safe Galaxy, Hungry Bear, um, Poo Coin. Uh, you're probably hearing about uh, VanCat, uh, no, all the rest, your Moon, uh, Moon Rat, all these different crazy name coins, right? Um, these meme coins. So we want to get you to be able to get into these and purchase and, and swap and have a good time. And uh, again, the guys, this is not financial advice, nor am I a financial advisor. Please do your own research. This is for tutorial purpose, educational pur purposes only. So let's get into it. I'm going to share my screen. I'm going to show you guys where to get started with your MetaMask wallet. So Deb, just a thumbs up that you can see my MetaMask extension on Google. Two thumbs up, we're ready to go. So two, you guys, you want to start with getting your MetaMask wallet account, getting started. So what you want to do is go out to Google. Well, again, in this, uh, first of all, guys, subscribe before you go any further. Subscribe, ring that bell. We're, we're coming to you with a lot of content, a lot of fun. Our, also, our partner, The Professor, aka Peter Gantner, is doing videos on different coins and dissecting and, and giving you a lot of great information. Today, listen, go out to uh, Google, MetaMask extension. I'm currently on the Brave browser because it's earning me BAT, uh, the BAT uh, crypto. So for browsing and, and clicking on ads, go ahead and go to MetaMask extension. Once you go there, it's going to take you to the Chrome web store of MetaMask right there on the right where it says remove from Brave. That's actually going to be red and it's going to say add to Brave. I've already got it there. So make sure you click on add to Brave. And if you notice in the top right corner, you see that little fox head there. That's the MetaMask logo. It's going to add it to your browser right there. Okay, so now when I click this little icon here, it's gonna pop up a drop down uh, for my MetaMask and you're going to just go through and set up your MetaMask. You're going to, um, you're gonna set up your, uh, all, all your goodies, your account, password, all that good stuff. But once you're set up, it's going to automatic, automatically be on the ethernet main net, okay? And that's where, uh, you can do all your uh, ERC20 transaction swaps, purchases, stuff like that. But we want to get what we want today to be able to get on Pancake Swap, to be able to do what we want to do with the Binance coin, the Binance Smart Chain, is we want to get our Smart Chain on here. So, how do we do that today? Well, I'm glad you asked. First of all, you can expand this view. By the way, is, is you can click these three little dots, click expand view, and you can it'll pop open your own little tab here. So expand your view. If you want a big wider view, that's what I suggest doing now. All you're going to have to do is we're going to add these links in the description below. So you don't need to copy these real quick, but we're going to go out. What I did is I Googled connecting my MetaMask to the Binance Smart Chain. And we're gonna, what comes up is academy.binance.com. We're going to scroll down and we're going to do a little copy and pasting here in order to get our Binance Smart Chain. So you see this area here that starts with mainnet. This is what you're probably looking for. This is most definitely what we're looking for. So these five line items here is what we're going to need. So as we go back to our MetaMask, we're going to click our little icon, this little circle uh, in the top right, and we're going to go down to settings. So you're going to click the settings tab, the very last item, line item there. And on the left tab menu that pops up, you're going to click networks. So once you click networks, you're going to see the top right in blue, it says add network. So you're going to click add network. Now, you just remember those five line items we just saw here? Those are going to match up to the ones that you're going to fill in here. So go ahead and copy smart 
just the smart chain, paste it in the line item over. Make sure you copy and paste all each of these five line items, okay? Once you have that done, you're going to click the save button. It's going to add the smart chain wallet. Deb, give me a thumbs up once you have done that and I can know that we have connected successfully and we have done well with our training on this, but you're, all right, two thumbs up, Deb is connected, congratulations. So now that you've got your smart chain wallet connected, you can go back into your uh, MetaMask. Now here's the important part, guys, and we'll do another video on this. When you're dealing with uh, the smart chain, the Binance smart chain uh, uh, coin, you're going to wanna to switch Ether, uh, Ethereum mainnet down to scroll down and you're gonna to go to select your smart chain wallet. Now, now we're dealing in our account. So if you ever realize that you have coins in your, uh, your uh, smart chain side and you, for whatever reason, switch over to Ethereum mainnet and all your coins are gone, don't freak out because you just need to switch back to your smart chain and they'll be there. So your main address, your main account is right here under where it says main account. And if you notice something here, guys, look at that address, OXDDA4, OXADDA4. The wallet address is actually the same for your BNB and Ethereum mainnet, but the biggest difference is the smart chain is BEP 20 and Ethereum is ERC 20, different, different on different main nets, but the address stays the same. So remember this last tip before we go into our next video. Congratulations, first of all, on setting up your MetaMask wallet with the MetaMask chain. But remember this tip, anytime you are sending or receiving from your Binance coin, which is the yellow logo, though this is inside your Binance chain. The Binance address is always starting with a lowercase BNB. Your smart, train, your smart chain Binance always starts with an OX, or I should say zero X, and then the rest of your address. So just a little tip to remember when dealing with going back and forth. Thank you for joining us today on setting up your MetaMask. We'll see you on the next video, guys. Thank you very much. Deb, thanks for being our main net test subject today. Say everybody hello and say goodbye. Bye, everybody. Thank you, Corey. Thank you, guys.